What's up? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can disconnect your Apple iPad Pro M4 from your iPhone so that when you receive calls and text messages, so that everything won't show up on your iPad along with your iPhone. Let's go. Welcome back to the video. My name is Sergio and in this channel I make life-saving tech videos. So if you're new here, make sure to subscribe. Also hit the bell if you want to get notified when I upload new videos. Also, if you want an epic custom phone case like these for your phone, check out the links down below in the description. All right, so let's get right to it. So I'm going to show you really quickly and easily how to disconnect your Apple iPad Pro M4 from your iPhone. So I know when you enter in your Apple ID on your iPhone, it pretty much connects everything to your iPhone. So when you receive calls on your iPhone, it's also going to show up on your iPad if your iPad is on. Okay, like this. Also, when you receive text messages on your phone and you're on the go, you're also going to receive them here on your iPad. And you may not want this. You may want to have your phone and your iPad completely disconnected and separate. All right, so that's what I'm going to show you how to do in this video. So let's jump right into it. So first off, I'll show you how to disconnect the phone calls. So how you do this is uh, you have to go into settings here in settings. Okay, you're going to scroll down to FaceTime, which is right here. All right. And then here in FaceTime, you're going to see this option right here. Uh, calls from iPhone. So you're just going to select that and just disable it. Okay, then you can go back. And now when you receive calls, let's go ahead and place another call. You will only receive the call on your iPhone. Okay, so there you go. Your iPad is now disconnected from phone calls from your iPhone. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you how to disconnect the messages so that every message you receive on your iPhone won't necessarily show up on your iPad. So how you do this is you once again go to settings on your iPad. Here in settings, you're going to scroll down to messages. And then here in messages, all you pretty much have to do is disable iMessage. So just do that. Now, when you receive messages on your iPhone, you will not receive them on your iPad. Let's go ahead and send myself a message. Boom. So I just sent myself a message. I should receive it here on my iPhone. There you go. And let's see if we got it on the iPad. And as you can see, it has not shown up here because I am not even signed in to the iMessage since we disabled it. All right, everyone, so that is how you disconnect your Apple iPad Pro M4 from your iPhone so that you don't receive phone calls and messages on the iPad that you would normally receive on your iPhone. Go ahead and destroy that like button. If this video helped you out, comment down below and let me know. That's all for this video. Catch you in the next one. As always, peace.